Eddie Kingston, Jake Hager going to war here in our opening contest of Rampage. Big right hand by Hager. Ooh, slap the face. Well, and Hager was screaming in the face of Kingston, but all oh, ended up with the eye. Kingston using those street fighting tactics. And the DDT. Well, that's Kingston. He knows. He knows how to crawl, fight, scratch, get whatever he's got to get in between those ropes to win. Eddie Kingston and Jake Hager. I mean, this, this stems from before that amazing, that brutal anarchy in the arena match back at Double or Nothing. This goes back to the disrespect shown by Jericho. Oh, yeah, no, you're correct. And I don't know if that, I don't, I don't know if the issues with Jericho and Kingston's ever gonna end. I feel like it's not, they hate each other. Look at Eddie here. Oh. oh. Listen to those chops, machine gun chops in the corner. You see Jake Hager trying to cover her up, but Kingston blistering the chest. Oh. Go for that suplex again. Still can't get it. Oh, oh. Got a little overzealous there. And the Hager bomb in the corner. He's gonna get him here. One, two. Kingston able to kick out. Good tight cover, Excalibur, by Jake Hager. Still to come tonight on this massive edition of Rampage. Satnam Singh makes his in-ring debut when he teams up with Jay Lethal. Tag team action. Former friends, now bitter enemies. Red Velvet, Chris Statlander collide. We will hear from Hook and Danhausen, plus Will Ospreay and Aussie Open walk through the forbidden door tonight in our main event when they take on Trent Beretta and FTR. That is sure to be a trios tag team classic. But gut wrench. But you see, Kingston has the, the hands clasped around the left knee. Nice of counter. Hager. Here's that exploder. Good job right there by Eddie on that counter. Jake Hager sent for a ride for a second time. Saito suplex. Hager gets the shoulders up. Kingston didn't have great distribution of weight on the shoulders of Hager. No, but I like the strategy. Two big explosive suplexes, then go for the cover and force Hager to kick out to exert more energy. It's smart by that man right there, Kingston. And especially after those rapid-fire chops to the chest. Kingston, oh. This is where he's deadly, Excalibur. This is where Kingston's deadly. These points in the match, later in the match, he's like a fine wine. That Urican, the spinning back fist, and Hager ducks it, the double oh, leg, and the mat return. Big time. Double into the mat return. Now the ankle lock. And Hager, notice. Hager dragging Kingston back towards center. A lot of range, long limbs by Hager with that tight ankle lock. The pain that Eddie must be in. And Eddie Kingston, oh, he's, he's digging in his fingernails into that canvas to try to make it to the bottom row. Oh, Hager, uh -oh. Hager dragging uh -oh. back in. Eddie might have to tap out right here. Oh, look at Hager. Change of position, you see the, the, the palm of his right hand. Those are not taps. And Kingston digs in and makes the, the ropes to force the break, but Hager hangs on for the extra punishment. Yeah, look at how, how Hager doesn't stop, even though Eddie got to those ropes. Hager got right on him quickly. And Taz, maybe the mission for Jake Hager here tonight is to take out Eddie Kingston ahead of the big blood and guts match. Make sure Kingston doesn't make it to Detroit. I'm sure that is the game plan and the strategy. Because I'll tell you what, this sense of urgency we're seeing in violence by Hager is wicked. Look at his shots here to the neck and head. Kingston absorbing the contact. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh Kingston oh. is a powerbomb desperation. You see Jake's head, his neck whiplash. Nasty. And oh, the spinning back fist. The Oricon, the oh. second one. It drops Hager. Kingston. Can he get it? Two, Can he get it? Can he get three. it? There is your winner, Eddie Kingston. Taz, usually all it takes is one to drop his opponent, but it took two to put away Hager. How damn tough is Jake Hager? Absolutely. He's got a granite like jaw, but. Eddie realized there was an opening Excalibur for that cover after the second spin it back punch, and, and it was perfectly timed on that cover, and he was able to top Hager for the victory. Very impressive. Both men beat the living hell out of each other.
This was a war of firefight. Eddie Kingston scoring the win.